Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah. That's all they got to do. That's all they got to do, my baby. Good bit. Oh, I got to show you something too. I'll show you in a minute. Why is that so far in there? Because it's probably the last one in the pack. Shout out to my workers. Shout out to my lurkers. Those in the front. Those in the back. Those in the side. Welcome. 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 Welcome to another episode of the Comedy Kitchen. Hey. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Let me tidy up a little bit around here. And then we will wait for people to come in. Today is Tuesday. Matter of fact, mommy, is this is the last Tuesday of the month. Woof. Lord Jesus. This month said, fly me to the moon. Do not let no wipes go away around here. Yeah, so this is the last Tuesday of this month, of May, mm -mm, of March. Excuse me, I'm pushing too fast. Yep, this has been, I believe this is one of the fastest, fastest months I've seen in a long time. It was in one time and out the other. But that's okay. We'll do it all over again some other day. Hope everybody's having a wonderful day, a great day. So far, so good day. On today's menu, for those that do not care for pork, this episode is not for you. Sorry. So we're going to have some smothered pork. We'll have, um, mommy, we're going to have boneless smothered pork chops. And with the red skin potatoes. Hey, too sweet for you. Good afternoon. How are you? Did it pop up? Or did it not pop up? I think, did it pop up, baby? Yeah. So we're going to have boneless pork chops. Because... Yeah, I don't have no bone in it, but it's okay. And with some, I don't know why I did that. With some red, red skin potatoes. That's one menu. It didn't pop up. Oh, well. You know why it didn't pop up? I thought, it, I thought I did it. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. I'm halfway not here and halfway not there. I thought I put the change. I thought I put the change in there earlier. I think I did. But it's okay. It's all right. It don't pop up. Basically, it's going to be um, boneless smothered pork chops with red skin potatoes. And I'm going to try something very, very different. Mommy, I'm going to try to do the remember those mussels I told that I got you? Mm -hmm. Do the mussels come do the mussels have shells on it? Yeah. The mussels have doors on down. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I have some um cheese tortellini and and do cheese tortellini and the mussels on the side. Like an uh like a cream, like a sauce. I'm not gonna cause I I, I figured that it might be some shells in there, but that's just something. You know, different. I don't know what I did about that uh, too sweet for you. Don't worry about it. It's okay. I just probably forgot something because I do that every once in a while. I thought I had gave myself enough time to put it in. So if it doesn't come up with exclamation, um, exclamation meal, 
Don't worry about it. It's okay. It'll pop up. It should. You know what I did? I put it in the stroll where it says menu, but I may not did I didn't put it in the other thing because it's like two on this one and then one on something else. So I probably forgot. It's all right. So that's what it's going to be today. Um, fairly, fairly quick. Not fairly quick, but it's kind of going, kind of sort of quick in a sense. But um, I'm just trying it out, trying to do something different today. Who that is? Hello. Hey, GJP Fool. Hey, love. How are you? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Just, um, you know, I always clean my stove before I do anything. But you have to do it kind of sort of fast in a sense because um, if the stove is on or you use the top of the eyes, It'll make the, um, this is just a commercial cleaner. It make it, gets real hard to um, maneuver. I put the stainless steel on the back cleaner and then I put the somewhat glass cleaner on the top. Hope everybody's having a wonderful day. Hope everybody's having a great, great, great day. Hey, hi, America. Oh, Lord. Block them, people. That's the one of the dumbest questions today. We ain't going, we're not going through that. Well, not we're not going to go through that. Why people? Listen, 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 listen. Thank you so very much. We're not going to start that mess. Because we come in peace and we don't have time for that. Hopefully that doesn't go on for the rest of the duration of this show. Because if we have to do something funky, we're going to do something funky. But we don't have time for that type of stuff. But I hope everybody's having a great day. Just give me another few minutes to get this here right and then we're gonna go ahead and go up in this thing and get it out the way um i'm just trying something different y'all because every once in a while you know how i get down i like to do something different give y'all something to to look at while i'm working it out and that's just how it works today is tuesday the last tuesday of the month hope everybody's doing wonderfully too sweet for you i know i hope that you are being blessed and okay and Taking your time and getting back where you need to be. Kiss my babies. Khadijah and Elijah. Kiss them babies for me. Let them know that I'm here. We're here together. Sending hearts and prayers all the way to where you are. Okay. Is everything sounding? You know, I got to get it. I got to get it. It's something about when you in the kitchen and you cook and you want to make sure things is right. And because y'all see what I see, but you know, y'all don't. Yeah, I just want to make sure it looks right. But you know, that's just how I am. I'm not a perfectionist. Because so when it comes to the kitchen, you know, you got to make sure your stuff looks right and it looks good at the same time. Hopefully everything is sounding okay. But we don't talk about that. Let's can we talk about that? Can we talk about that? There is, I'm going I'm gonna speak about it. If anybody else don't speak about it, I'm gonna speak about it. There is a new, how would I want to say it? How do I want to, how would I want to announce him if I had to announce him? There is a new sheriff in town. Yes, I said it. It's a new sheriff in town. It is um the uh epic analysis is the, if i'm saying it correctly the epic analysis let me tell you something now i i love i love a man that has a, a, a sexy voice and i met him in a matter of fact i met him in dj hot one's room and club wet wet and we were just texting you know typing back and forth in the chat or whatever like that 
never knew that he was going to come out from God knows where, from God knows what. But let me tell you, baby, baby, his voice. When somebody says they, they can put you to bed, when somebody says they can put you to sleep, I mean, in a nice way, not sexual, nothing like that. I'm just talking about that voice, that voice that will go and touch the back of your liver. I'm just saying what I'm saying because I've been in his room several times and he made my liver move. I mean, he he made my liver move. I'm just want to let you know right now that my liver was quivering. It was it, it was. I can't tell you. I just can't. I can't tell you. All I can tell you is, hey, sis, all, all I can tell you is when you go into this man's room, going in with the open mind. Because he's going to lock your soul up. He's going to lock your soul up. What we this? This young man, his name is the Epic Analysis. I know you've seen him in several people's rooms, but this young person has came out and yes, he plays music and and he talks. And the way he talks, I'm saying he makes my liver quiver. I mean, he makes me want to say liver, rice and gravy and onions. I'm just saying. So whenever you see this man comes on, when he comes on, because he's trying to make affiliate, and um, I don't quite know, but Too Sweet For You is also his mod. His name is The Epic Anal Analysis. Hey, DJ Double O, thank you for subscribing. Thank you so much. Salute, my king. He comes on. Too Sweet For You, please put his time in the chat because she also mods for him. But baby, baby, when he calls your name out, he reaches in and gets your liver. He grabbed my liver, girl. I haven't had my liver snatched in a minute. It's almost six years going on March. No, going in November, I had my liver snatched. But he snatched the living livers out of my... He gives his girlfriend. Yeah, yes, I like that one. He snatched my soul. He snatched my soul. Whew. Baby, all I can tell you is, he can put me to bed. He can put me to sleep. Just by his voice. Hello? I just had a moment. If y'all don't, if y'all not follow him, if he decides to come into the room, if ever you see him, if it's the epic analysis, boy, my heart goes pitter patter, pitter patter. With that being said, this is the wine today, which are from our vegan line collection. Uh, sip and shares wines.com collection. This right here is the reasoning. Isn't this the beautiful bottle you ever seen? No, I haven't opened this bottle. I've been looking at the bottle, I want to say, for almost a week's time. It's a beautiful bottle. It's very slim and it's blue and it's very nice. Um, I'm going to hold this bottle um, till I want to say April the 7th when New York Boss Lady. Unscripted comes up and she does her um, ship and share. Um, uh, how are we going to say it? Discussion. Um, we just, ladies and gentlemen, are also invited. Um, all you must do, if you're able to, is purchase a bottle of the vegan wine. Any selection will do. And um, we get up here and we talk, we talk about it. We, we analyze it. We smell it. We just rotate it in our glasses and we have a great time. Um, those that's not familiar with this particular wine or any of the collection of wines, you do not, I repeat, you do not feel bad after you drink it. Um, you feel like you might want to run a marathon the next morning. Yes, vegan. And if this, my, my kind that I have is the sweet, I like sweet wines, like the, the white Zinfandel and those stuff. She also have a dry, dry, dry wine, but I like sweet wines. I like sweet wines. Um, uh. The Awakening is also sweet. This one here is also sweet. And this other one, the Moscato, is also sweet. Yeah, they are usually sweet. But you know what? This right here is um very, very wonderful. Very great with um a little cheese and crackers, a little pate. Um, you know, maybe some ravioli, some type of meat sauce or non-meat sauce. Some clams, some um, shrimp, fish. It goes... it. Pile is very real with that. 
the, there is not that much percentage of alcohol in this particular bottle. This bottle right here is 13% um, by volume. How do, how do I wash your show? You, hold me. How do you watch my show? Hold me. You have to download an app. Download, when somebody is asking me how to watch my, download the Twitch app. It's free. And then look for this. Now I'm looking to y'all and somebody's asking me stuff over here. Sorry about that. So you got to download the app. Uh, see, I, I be, I be um, networking, politicking at the same exact time. You too can do the same exact thing. Um, uh, hold on a minute, y'all. I was going today. Well, I, was going, I was going to put it up. Click the link. I was going to put it up on uh, Facebook today, but unfortunately, um, due to me not really having enough sleep to do too much of anything, because I worked last night, I worked a full eight hour shift, and I went to the grocery store and bought some stuff, and then I came on home. You double O, D double O. Now you know. You know how we get down. We try to, we try to, we trying to raise this family. We trying to get, we trying to build an empire on Twitch. We trying to build an empire, so you know, you too can do this. How you like that double up? New York boss lady hit me with the, hit me with the hula hoop. She hit me, she hit me with the hula hoop, and she's the one that went ahead and got me the, the hula. She said thanks. Yeah, hit the link, hit the link. You know how we do. We have we have fun. We have fun under the sun and then some. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and I know I'm just doing too much. I am too busy. That's my little um red skin potatoes right there. So like I said, this this meal here is something that we're gonna put this together. I'm gonna put this together. So we got some of the red potatoes, red skin potatoes. I've got some little mushrooms right here. You know, I'm going to throw something together. I hope everybody's having a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful day today. Last Tuesday of the month. Before you know it, it'll be what? It's the first of the month. Cash your checks and come on. So you know how that thing goes. Um, As for me, I'm sorry I wasn't here last week. Was kind of sort of under the weather. It happens a lot to me now. Some days I have to take some days off because I be grinding a little bit too hard and my body says sit down. So this meal may not be for some because um, do not hit exclamation point um, menu because I made a mistake and I didn't add it into the menu so you'll get a blank. So basically it's going to be the mussels with the cheese tortellini and then it's going to be the pork chops boneless boneless pork chops with um red skin potatoes yeah let us figure we're going to throw this together make it do what it do so with the tortellini let me show you what this look like It says cheese tortellini made with 100% some Romano cheese and all natural spices. Uh, blah, blah, blah. So bring four quarts of water to a bowl, add frozen tortellini and boil water, reduce heat to low simmer, stir, gently cook uncovered for approximately two to three minutes on desired tenderness, drain well and serve. Quick, hey, me? Quick, fast, in a hurry. I don't think any of the commands are working. That's just how it works today. You know what? Don't even worry about it. We're going to keep the train going. Too sweet for you. You just sit there and look sexy as you normally do. Because I know you are. Don't worry about the commands. Bump them. Freestyle it. We don't care. We're just happy to be here among friends and family. Who needs commands? In the course of a day, we all command we command out. Feel free to put whatever you want in the chat. Because that's what we're going to do today. Um, I'm so full of full of stuff today. Yeah, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. 
Because the world still goes around and around and we don't need commands. Bump them. Bump them. Command. We don't. We don't need them. I don't, I don't, I don't mess everything up today. Don't even worry about it. Some days you just, you know, well, some days you just go against the grain. Bump it. Big, big bump it. Who cares? You're trying. Uh, okay, go to your app store on your phone. So, yes, get some kung fu. Hey, baby, I've been watching you. You've been hitting those weights. You've been looking really good. You've been looking really good. Everybody, y'all want to get that summer body? If you can't get it this summer, you can get it next summer. At least start right now. Do a little bit of walking. Yes, I'll be watching you. I'll be watching folks, but I don't think I'm watching because I am. I'm going to use that whole entire bag. This bag right here is supposed to be three pound bags of these fresh farm red potatoes. We already know that's not a whole big old bag of bag and potatoes. That would look like it was not enough to do anything with, but that's okay. That is okay. So I'm going to wash my potatoes because guess what? You got to wash your potatoes. I'm keeping my skin on. And you know what y'all say? You could have did it earlier. I know I could have, but I didn't do it. We're going to wash them. We're going to keep the skin on them. Because, you know, most of your protein and all your wonderful stuff is where? In the skin. Sometimes it's all right to have some skin in your life. Nothing wrong with a little skin. Shout out to my workers, my lurkers. GDOO, I know he's at work, so I know. Shout out to my workers and my lurkers. Those in the front, those in the back, and those on the side. Welcome to Comedy Kitchen. With your host, with the most, Chef Zumba Baby One. These are one of the little itty bitty potatoes. They came from a little itty bitty farm. This is a little itty. So this right, I know I'm saying some weird stuff. So welcome to, there we go. Look who came into the, ch and she went and put a government name up here, up here. Lord, you made me laugh. I'm not, I'm not going to be able to say the way I should say it, because I can't do it. I'm, I'm going to say how I normally say it. That right there is doctor, my bestie, my, my, my cohort, my coworker, my friend, my love. That is Dr. Clay Rogers. She is, yes, she is a doctor, and I'm not able to call her by her name without not saying Dr. Clay Rogers. So that is my buddy. That's my love from the job. We worked together last night. Inside joke. So that is Dr. Clay Rogers. Yes, she is. She is my sweet 100. Are you still on land or are you on sea? Thank you for subscribing again. Thank you. Thank you. We have many with 10 months in. Thank you. Thank you for hanging in with me. Thank you so very much for hanging in with me. Yes, Dr. Clay Rogers is a certified bona fide doctor. Like, <laughs> doctor. So I cannot call her no other way but say doctor. Yes. You're on land. Sweet 100 is on land. She is the only person that I know that will be on land one minute and she be on sea next. So she won't go back out until May the 22nd through the 29th, if I'm correct. Because the 29th is what? My birthday of May, that is. Thank you, Dr. Clay Rogers. I know you should be sleeping, but I'm so blessed that you came into my room. My Sukasa, you Sukasa. Thank you so very much. So this meal that I'm putting together... um. I'm just going to throw it together. I washed some red skin potatoes. We're going to boil that. Um, I have some cheese tortellini right here. Um, we're going to boil that. And then I'm going to do the, the boneless pork chops. And then I'm also going to do the mussels. The mussels that I'm using right now, because they come in diff different ways, but the way I'm going to do this is... 
you can buy the loose muscles at the at the um seafood store or whatever you want to go to happy tuesday everyone i get these from this it's already it's already cooked so for those um someone had suggested about doing like a 30 minute uh quick fast on the go type of meal so i am trying this out for the first time i don't eat mussels i don't think nobody should eat that but that's just me i don't eat mussels but these mussels are already pretty much cooked um, and they locked in their flavors. So we're going to, some of these muscles might have a um, shell in it, but I'm going to put that to the side. Hey, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the chat. So this is something different. I don't know. I can't taste it because I don't like seafood. I don't like, unless it's shrimp, I can eat all day. But stuff like this, anything that's got a muscle in it, I can't put that in my mouth. No pun intended. Oh, DJ, DJ Reg. Blessings, blessings, welcome, welcome. Wow, how you doing today, Reg? Welcome, happy Tuesday, happy, happy Tuesday. Well, I'm a ding dong. So, we're gonna pull out all the stops today. We got everybody coming, coming into the chat. Welcome to the chat. Got a little scallions, little onions. Got little onions. Um, This right here, since this is real a meal for my brother because that's for him. These here is the pork chops with no bones. So it's boneless. It's just the meat and no bones. He didn't care. And I was trying to do something different. So these are boneless pork chops. Just the, the fat, not the fat, just the meat of the pork chops. We're going to go ahead and we're going to like saute those a little bit. Y'all know. For those that don't eat pork, turn your back. So this is what that looks like. It's just the meat with no bone. I know that sounds weird to have meat with no bone, but hey, it is what it is. If it is, it is what it is. Dr. Dr. Clay Rogers, I hope that you got you got you some sleep from last night. Cause guess what? I did it. I've been up ever since I left you this morning. I know I ain't got good sense. You know that. And I'll be back tonight. So I know you won't be there. So. Always, always, always wash your meat. No burrs. I don't blame you. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be there either if I didn't do what I did. I uh, went ahead and picked up. Because you know me. I make it do what it do. So I have my meat sitting over there. We're going to do a couple of these scallions. Bring my bag right here because y'all don't want to keep turning my back on y'all. I think that is so rude that I do that so every once in a while. Got to get Big Daddy out. Got Big Daddy. But cheers. You what type of what type of wine? Well, look. What what you sipping on? What are you sipping on? I'm not sipping today, but I do have my bottle right here. My vegan wine that I've always talks about when we at work together. I'm gonna wait till next week when I have a day off and I'm really like um oh, really get down on some of that right there. But it's always nice to have a nice glass of something shabbily or something something. Bring it down. But cheers, cheers, cheers. Cheers to a wonderful day. And hopefully you're off today. Or well, at least not where I'm at today. But we will be together soon. So I got everything pretty much laid out. You know, onions is very good in any meal if you are if you're an onion person. Oh, here we go. Yeah, boss lady, thank you so much for gifting Dr. Clay Rogers. And she's a real true doctor. Dr. Clay Rogers, a, a subscription to my channel. Now she's really going to enjoy me because we work together and, and we laugh together. So one thing I can say with the um, pandemic being what it is, it's always nice to have someone that you can talk to and you can laugh with. And I'm very grateful to have that with her in our own special conversations that we have together um 
you can put as much onions you would like in your food if you are a person that loves onions. I think onions makes everything taste so much better. But there was something that I seen that I seen on TikTok because, you know, I'm a TikTok freak. And I know it's going to blow your mind because it blew my mind. And I'm going to see if I can do it. J. Mata, Tape Deck Tuesday, 10 o'clock tonight. Let me see if I can do it. Got to make sure. Now, I know I might not can't do it because guess what? I might not can't do it. I can't do it because I don't, I don't have the right top. But, you know, we all sit around here and mess with these um these spices and not able to get the spices out the hole. It's a way that you can twist it and the spices come out. It's very comical for those like myself. But it's comical. Hey, y'all. So with the onions, I'm not going to do anything special with that. We're just going to chop those down because what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Okay, everybody's having problems. I think Twitch is twitching because I'm getting messages. Something's going on. But it's okay. The show must go on because I wasn't on last week. So we're going to make it do what it do. I am happy for those that are here. And anybody that's having a hard time in the back, don't get discouraged. Just keep on trying. Keep on trying to get in. Because I like to shout out to my workers, my lurkers, those in the front, those in the back, those in the side, and those that's just unable to get in right now. We know you're here. We can feel your spirit. You know, I keep my eyes on what I'm doing here. So when, I, when I'm using Big Daddy like this right here, got to make sure I don't put no fingers in my food. Or like cut my finger in the food to be exact. With the pork chops, we're going to um, season them with the regular salt and pepper, put a little flour on there, give them a little drench a little bit, and then we're going to smother them. And that's when I'm going to drop the onions on top of them. You can cook it with it, or you can just drop it in a little bit later. That's if you like onions. Hi, welcome to the chat. How are you doing, RK0171710? How are you? I hope you're doing okay. Thank you. Welcome, welcome to the chat. Feel free to mingle around. That's just a little onions. I'm doing fine. How are you? I'm doing okay. No complaints over here with me. Hopefully, hopefully you're okay. Okay, now I'm multitasking here. Respect. So, we're gonna we're gonna come out with the um, old faithful. Copper chef. I'm gonna use the grill one. Wish I could smell. You know what? Onions have a just a just a unique smell. I mean, even if it's not even with the flame on it, you can still smell that freshness when you just cut it. it smells so good. It smells so good. When I use my things with here, I like to turn them sideways because you don't want to hit that and hit yourself, and then you're gonna hurt yourself, and that's gonna hurt. And you don't want that thing. Got a little all-purpose flour here, because guess what? You got to have that all-purpose flour. <laughs> yeah, I love onions myself. Onions, just, mm. onions, onions and ginger is a wonderful combination. I want... Ask, wait a minute, sis, what you talking about, sis? What you want to ask? Because you know how you 
What you want to ask, baby? From one. Oh, Lord. Uh, sis, handle that. You already know what that is. We're going to have some. We're going to have some. We're going to have some problems. Take care of that, baby. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you what an old person told me. When people see you doing things, they'll try to run interference on you. Now, we've been doing so well with having people not interfering with our, with our juju, with our, with our intertwinement. This is just some all-purpose flower. Don't let the devil steal your joy by no means necessary. We come in peace and we and we flow in peace. I'm just saying. People, we don't we don't have time for that. The world is already so corrupt as it is, and we don't have time for anything other than that. So we're gonna go ahead and just um season your flour, people. Season your flour. If you want to do anything with your meat, make sure you season it. The meat that is. Just a lot of salt and pepper. I'm not gonna use any smack your mama. Cause I like to put my smack my mama on my chicken. I like to, hey DJ G, the merciless. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I like to use my slap my mama. Well, slap. Yo mama on my chicken. I don't do that no other way but chicken. I will not slap my mama. And y'all do not hear her right now because she's talking to my sibling. One of my matter of fact. Mommy, yeah. you walking back? Oh, because I said if you didn't hear my mama, she's talking to one of my siblings. Who which one was that? Which one of the does was it Dindin or sister? Oh then Okay. Does she be working home? She don't never have to go back in the office. She would never have to go back in office. The lucky devil. What? Yeah. That. Just that she could change location or two. And she want to. She go to DC and still have work. Don't tell her that. No, she'll never make it. She'll never come back. Don't tell her that. Don't tell her that, Ma. Don't tell her. Don't tell her anything about DC right now. Please don't do that. Cause she'll never come back. I'm just seasoning the, the flower to the um. Watch out. Mom, mama's in the room now, y'all. Mama's in the room. They didn't no, they didn't they didn't hear you because you had got us or walked out. Good evening. They can hear you, mom. Now what they gonna say? Ma say good evening. I know y'all heard her. Yeah. So basically I just went ahead and sprinkled some black pepper and the seasoning salt and just sprinkled it around in the flour. So this meal right here, like I say, is Marge is gonna make you laugh. Dr. Clay Rogers, she's a full-fledged doctor at the hospital I work with. She went ahead and came in and chimed in and got into the chat. So she said, Hi, Mom. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Ain't that something? She's a she's a doctor. She's a doctor. There's a doctor in the house. There's a doctor. Yeah. Yes, girl. See, I can't. I I can I can cut and joke up in front of her, and she won't. She won't say anything like that. She's crazy. She won't do me like that. Now, some other folks might say that, but she won't. That's just some water. It's not hot. I'm just taking it off from where I got it at. Now you know what? I'm about to say something awful. No, I'm not gonna say nothing awful. I'm going to move my onions out the way. Like I said, this meal is not made for everyone because it's pork. So those that don't like pork, turn your back. Hey, bro. My kid in the room. Ma said, hey. Now, these are just the, these, these are just the pork chop with no bones. Yes, everybody that don't eat pork, turn your back. This is a meal for my brother. Now, it's okay to stab your meat. If you have a, what you call that thing, the mallet, I have one. But the last time I used my mallet, I killed everything 
I think I messed up some peanuts and I don't like messing with it. So I like to put some little holes in the meat. That way, the seasoning can go down it because I'm also going to season my meat. Now, I don't know if everybody does this or not, but it's all, like I say, season your flour and then also season your meat because nobody wants some dull meat or plain meat or unseasoned meat. They're kind of, you know, they're going to shrink up anyway. Most, <laughs> most meat does uh, shrink up. We do not use the commands today because guess what? The commands are not working. So do not worry about that. Feel free to put whatever you want to put in the chat. Respectfully. That was cool. You doing all right back there, Mom? Yeah. You need some water or something? No, I'm fine. Okay. You didn't take your medicine? Mm. You're supposed to have it with your breakfast. Might put a little bit of butter. What should I do, Ma? Should I go ahead and just um saute it with a little bit of butter, a little bit of oil, and then I'm gonna go ahead and smother it and put it in. The, I'm gonna put it in the oven. I'm gonna put the whole pan in the oven because those pans are supposed to go from stove to oven. So sear first and then put it to the frame. I'm going to um, frame a bit on top. Uh huh. Just a little bit, both sides, and then we'll place it put it in the oven. I mean, I'm going to put the flour on it and sear it, and then put it in the oven. What? What am I doing? Oh, you, I ain't going to say what I want to say. You know how I talk. That's, that, that is part of our, um, that is part of our spicy chat conversation. <laughs> got to, you got to put a little, got to put a little oomph to it. Gotta put a little oomph to it. Um, bum, 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 Did I say, did I say butter or the, or we're going to use virgin oil just for a little bit of pan? Butter and pan. Say something. Both of them. I keep doing this. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, probably say, what she just keep doing? Remember, remember this? Remember the last time I pulled this out and say, oh, you got butter. No, it's green peppers and red peppers. You can use it for stories. I keep doing the same one, Mom. It's okay. It's all right. What that bag? He probably did. This is a butter. Yeah, he probably did. That's all right. The darnest stuff. Um, you can't. You can't get mad. You just do it so many times. You're like, ah. Yeah, I think he did. I don't know who put that in there, but it's all right. It's okay. Do, do. Probably do, could probably do the same. We we'll probably do the same thing with the um with the um muscles. Mm. 
That sound good, honey. Anita Dawn. We got to find a name for her. Anita Dawn. The the Ray Train Extraordinaire. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I know you at work. Shout out to my workers, my lurkers, those in the front, those in the back, those that are just here. Happy Tuesday. Trying to mix the butter and mix the oil together. One easy bag. Stand the F up. Hey, one easy bag. How you doing? How are you? Yes, look at the, mm hmm Look, that ain't nothing but love right there. Anita Dawn and one easy Mac. Came in at the same exact time. Did y'all did y'all ride in on the same car? Or did y'all have the same Uber? Which one y'all come in? I'm just making sure my butter and my um, virgin oil is mixed up very, very nicely. And matter of fact, I'm going to go ahead and one, two, three, three, six. Once I get a nice sear on it, it's going to go straight in the oven. I'll turn the oven on in a minute. Mommy, what you doing? You painting? What you painting? Fish. Fish? It's nice. Fishes are nice. Thoughts with something. Hope everybody's doing wonderful. I need a dawn. Yes, they <laughs> That's a bouncing fish head. Wow. That's cool. All right. See you. See you soon. What do now? So we're gonna move these um turn your back those that don't like pork chops. Turn your back. Because I need to um I gotta talk to Mr. Potato Head. I just went ahead and just, um, we're going to keep the skins on, Mr. Tater. I didn't do no prep time. Say, yes, I did say that. Oh, what easy Mac gifted. Oh, I need a Don. That one easy Mac. Thank you so very much for that gift. It's up to her. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, how do I want to do my potatoes? Do I want to, I say mashed potatoes. That's what I did say. What do you think, Mom? Mash them? She had a taste for it. Yeah, I did have a taste for mashed potatoes. But I don't think I'll be eating potatoes a day because my stomach is acting right again. I had to use the rest of my Pepto Bismo or my Maylux. Yes, yeah, it's Mr. It's Mr. Mr. Potato Head. I love you. Y'all know about Mr. Potato Head. I'm going to take my time with this and just go ahead and just slice them. reason why I slice them, because you know I have one of the hardest times with potatoes. Me and potatoes fall out every time you turn around. They don't, don't, we don't get along. Mr. Potato Head, I love you. Yes. What easy Mac, how are you feeling today, dear? How's anybody feeling? Put a one in the chat if you're feeling groovy. Put a two in the chat that you just say, all right. And just put a zero in the chat that you just don't, don't even, today is just Tuesday. One is good, two is on, and zero is on. Thank you, thank you. Um, you one, you know you fabulous, Dr. Clay Rogers. You know you fabuloso, you fabulous. I know you grinding. You 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 grind harder than the man outside that cuts my grass. You grind harder than anything any other person in the world. Make that money. I do the same exact thing too. That's right. I see all those ones in the chat. Yes, all those beautiful ones in the chat. Yeah. 
It's been been a very, very busy, busy. And this is, a, what, the second day of the week? It's been very, very busy. I figure if I slice them, that way when I can cook them, because the last time I did potatoes, we just had a big old falling out. Potatoes got mad with me. Now, what easy mac about the commands are not working today. So basically what I'm doing is um, there's two, two different meals going on. One is those that don't like um, pork chops. Um, I'm going to do some boneless pork chops, smothered boneless pork chops with the red skin potatoes that's right here. Then I'm also going to have the tortellini. I'm going to have the mussels with the cheese tortellini. Try to make a little sauce with that. You know, try to make a little saucy. Uh-oh, I missed something. I need to know what's going on with you and your boss lady, baby. She's showing that love. She's giving that love out there. She's giving that inspirational love. Yes. She's a loving person. She's a sweet, she's a sweetheart. My butter oil is frying a little bit right here. I'm about to put the um pork chops in there, the boneless pork chops. This meal is for my brother anyway. Yeah, you make everybody feel good. Besides, besides my real life doctor that's in the room. She makes me feel good too. She gives me great conversation. And we just and we can laugh and and you know and still be respectful at work. And that's one thing you always need to have is that one person that work going to take me some pork chops out the freezer. Did you sweet 100? Yes. Yeah, pick me some pork chops out the freezer. I'm not eating it. I'm just making this for my brother because I'm that type of loving sister. And I ain't know what else to cook, to be honest with y'all. Because I wasn't up here, I wasn't up here last week. So I figured, you know what? Um, let's go ahead and make it do what it do. Even though I don't eat it, don't mean he can't have it. Did you? Thank you so very much. I knew somebody would be missing me. I mean, I know all y'all miss me when I'm not up here. Cause we don't have no spicy chatter. I ain't doing something halfway crazy or my mom is not saying something to me, you know. Y'all miss that. That's where the comedy kitchen come in at. Some people say drench. Is it drench, ma, or just flour, lightly flour? Check the access off. That's the way you do it? And that's the way I like to do it. Just the way my mom do. Uh-oh. No. Uh, DJ G the Merciless do not eat pork chops. That I know. If I had some chicken, I think he might would eat some with me, though. <laughs> Thank you. I'll be playing around. I'll be playing. You know how I do. I'm really a jokester. Off the clock and on the clock, to be honest with you. Now, you know I love me some chicken. I'll talk about chicken all day long. This part, I think this might be one of the second shows that I've ever done that I have not made chicken. Now, doesn't, that's the only thing about this pot, they do slide. Now, doesn't mean I don't have any chicken in the cut, though. I was not going to cook it today. Not in, not in, not, because, um, since I'm on a, on a little bit of a time schedule today, because I need to get myself unwind, unwind and, and get myself ready for another fun field. Um, excursion for the night because I am going back in tonight I'm going at 11 o'clock 
I'm going to make it fit. You got to push it in, shove it in. We're going to let it sheer, sear on one side. Let the butter and the oils go there. And then I'm going to flip it over. That's where you get that um little, the little bit of a slight, not, I don't want to say a crust. It's not going to be a crust, but it's like a little bit of fried. Then I'm going to flip it on the other side. Then I'm just going to probably drizzle it with a um, with little, bit, little bit of the vinegar, a little bit of apple cider vinegar. Or just leave it the way it is. Leave it the way it is. Okay. Leave it the way it is. Flip it, flip it. Sometimes you might see my pot slide across because it just, it's level, but sometimes it's weird stuff happens. As long as it don't hit the floor. DJ Tam Jam, the lady of all stories. She has stories for you. And they're beautiful stories. It's her life story. DJ Tam Jam. I'm going to drop a little bit of onions in there just so we can talk to the pork chop. DJ Tam Jam, turn your back. You don't eat pork. I know that. DJ Tam Jam does not eat pork and... Uh, Joe So Fab does not eat mushrooms. I pay attention. Oh, all, all eyes on deck. to hit another pot. Y'all have never seen me not have a glass of wine when I'm cooking. That is also a first. That is showing up a first. You know what else is a first, mommy? I have no soda. Yes, I had to take myself off of soda. Due to acid reflux. So no, I'm doing cold. You know what? I'm about to get me a glass of water. I've never cooked without something in my hand. So as you may see, uh, if you see that right there, you see the little two right there that I just turned over, a little sheer in there, little right there. Um, yeah, I can't believe that. Oh my God, I'm getting old. Not a glass of wine, not soda. I got to drink some water. We're going to flip it over just like that right there. We're going to cook it on one side, and then we're going to flip it and cook it. Thank you. Yes, that's that wine there, yes. We're going to cook it on one side, flip it on the other side. That's okay. I'm going to get myself together. I'm just going to have to just... The older you get, things be changing. You know, I put just a little bit of onions in there. Now, that's what all that looked like when I flipped it over. Can y'all see that? Because the DJ Big Marvel in the room has said something. See that? See that? Those that don't eat pork, turn it back. Now, you know, when you're cooking your, your meat, you do not want to overcook it because you don't want your meat to be what? Dry. Who wants dry meat? You, not us. I know DJ Tam Dan. This meal is not my meal. This meal is for my brother. I get some water. Come on. Uh -huh. ah. Yes, ma'am. We're going to drink it. We're going to drink it. Thank you, mommy. Oh, good Lord. Ugh. Oh. Well, somebody said this is a hard pill to swallow. This is a hard pill to swallow. So, water. Salute. And it's cold. Give Ma a glass. Yeah, Ma has one. 
My mother drinks. My mother drinks water like it's going out of style. As you may see, because you know me, I have the water be all piled up right here because it goes about this high. We had to move the other. Well, we got to move the other thing of water over here too because it's like down there real low. They ain't on sale yet. So until they go back on sale, they'll get back high. They're not on sale. They wasn't on sale this morning. Ugh. Harsh. Ugh. Fire truck or ambulance? Man, you can tell the difference down here. Okay. You can't tell the difference. That's a fire truck. They don't come up and down these streets that often. Hope there's nothing bad going on. Look, I'm not going to go out and look out the door. They are nicely with these with these copper chef. You can just put like a little bit of oil, a little bit of um, butter, and it just keep right on searing and cooking and all up in there. Are we going? No, no, I didn't give up wine. I need a dawn. No, don't don't say that. No, I don't give up wine. I just have to work late on tonight, and I don't want to really mess up a good thing. But I need a dawn. Since you spoke of wine, I have my bottle right here for next week. My reasoning, yes. We we never give up the finer things of life, of vegan wine. I have my bottle right here. I've been watching it since last week. And um, I'm just going to say it's going to be great, and I'm going to enjoy it. No, no. I, I do not give up wine. No. I am just not having wine today because I got to go to work tonight at 11 o'clock. That's why I have it. I'm not going. I don't want to mess up a good thing. No, no. I, I gave up soda. I gave up Dr. Pepper first, and then I gave up Coke because it bothers my stomach. So there will be no soda now. But the wine, you get down with it, get down. The wine will be good. No, I can't not. No, I can't live by a glass of wine. I would have no sense at all. And if you leave it, and I'm going to flip it one good time again, because you see how nice I'm flipping it. If you leave it just there, I can get the little lines on it, because the bottom of the pan has lines in it, like them grill lines. I just want to make sure my meat is um, done. Come on, pot. Boil. You're doing good. This pot right here in the back, if you can see it. Yes. With me. That's right. So everybody, those that came in the chat a little bit later, that is my doctor. That's my bestie friend, Dr. Clay Rogers. We speak about um the vegan wines. So New York Boss Lady and um DJ Tam Jam, also Anita Don. All of us have frequent different bottles of the vegan wine. Yes, thank you for putting that up there. Um, and each wine has a, a special taste, a, a special flair, and it's very, very good. Um, we're going to get together. I'll let you know. I'll bring the paper and stuff in so that you can um, lurk and hey, so you can see what we see. And then maybe we can we can talk about some wines. These bottles are $22, $22 a bottle. Um, shipping, if you order today, which is Tuesday, you should have it by at least by Friday. Two days shipping right to your door. All that I can say is if you want to wait like I do, I'll wait to the door because I don't want nobody going to the porch and stealing my bottle of wine because they get a two piece of biscuit. So we don't want that to happen. It's very, very good wine. I recommend it. And everybody else in the chat has had a bottle or two or three or four. Maybe five. DJ um, Sergeant P has had multiple bottles. All of us, I think I had probably two or three or four probably bottles. 
we had the Awakening, we had that one, we had the Moscato, and it was something else. So I had like four bottles of wine, and they're all good. Yes. What wine are you what what wine are you drinking on? Um, Dr. Clay Rogers. What, what what are you sipping on today? I know it's good. I'm trying to make sure my meat have a spot here. Because, you know, meats uh, shrink up in the pan. Sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. Just so I can seal in some of those lovely juices. Let the juices go up in there. DJ Sanji, how are you? You um, you allergic to sulfur? Well, this right here would not give you a headache at all. Thank you, Dean Tam Jeff. This right here would not give you a headache. You do not feel bad. You don't have that, I don't want to wake up in the morning feel because I feel awful bad. You do have, do not have that feeling whatsoever. I have to be honest with you. We be up here with New York Boss Lady unscripted and we have our discussions about the wines and everything. Um, we could knock out a whole bottle. And... Yes, we have. And don't feel bad about it the next morning at all. DJ Sanji, welcome. To keep your back turn. Keep back turn, DJ Cham Dan. Don't turn around. Just. Well, thank you for coming through, lurking. Another fabulous, another fabulous. You have to come into her show on Thursdays. To see what she do. The voice. The finesse. The cigars. And the hats. Need I say more? DJ Sanji. Keep your back turned, DJ um, Tim Jam. So what I'm going to do is. You smell that, my I don't want to overcook that. So I'm going to smother the juices right there. Should I just go ahead, Ma, and put the and put the oven on warm? Put it in too long. Don't put it in too long. No, but don't go in that shape. Ma'am. No, of course it's sharp. No, it sure ain't. I'm just gonna let it sit in the oven. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna put that top in there. I'm just gonna shove this. Whole, I'm gonna place this whole thing in there. The angel goddess, hey, hi sis, welcome, welcome, come on in the room. DJ CS in the VA, welcome, come on in the room. Hey y'all, come on in, come on in, come on in the room, come on in. DJ CS in the VA. You trying to smell it? Oh, you can smell it. It's it's definitely cooking up in here. It's cooking, cooking. So someone else will say. Um, like I said, disclaimer: those that are coming into the room right now. I am cooking pork. So if you're not a pork fan, turn your back. Turn your back. DJ, hey, how are you? Welcome, welcome. Come on in the room. Welcome. Hey, everybody, we got guests. We got company. Come on in. DJ Butter L, how are you? You know where I'm at, DJ, uh, uh, Dr. Uh, Clay Rogers. You know where I'm at. You know how to find me. I'm just going to put this in the oven just to keep it in the oven just so that I can seal the juices. Don't want to over, overwhelm them because guess what? We do not want that to happen. We want them to stay just the way they are. Jenny Buttell, how are you? Please act like you don't want to boil. Me and potatoes go way back like car seats. Okay. Mm 
I'm gonna cut this eye off. We're gonna put that in the oven. Gigi, how are you, Gigi Buddell? Are you doing okay? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Are you working and lurking? Cause I got a lot of people that's working and lurking tonight, today. We're gonna probably just sit that in the oven. Um, DJ Big Entertainment. Hey, welcome, 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 welcome. Come on in. Those potatoes over there are not. You're working and lurking. I am too. I'm working in this kitchen, but when I finish getting anything put put together, put down or whatever, I'm going to take myself, spruce up a little bit, and put myself in the bed because I got to go back tonight. I got to make that money, boo-boo. Got to make that money, baby. I got to make that money until I hit that lottery. And that's not going to be anytime soon. <laughs> but I thank everybody for being in the room. Everybody make a new friend. Or two or three or four. I'm going to keep the skin on the red potatoes. Come on, mash all that down. Put a little, little bit of a heavy cream. Maybe a little bit of milk. A little bit of butter and mash it on down. Put it on down up in that pot there. You got you got to play to be in it. You got to play. I don't want to lose. I don't want to lose what I'm making. So you know, I don't I don't uh, waste like a light bill. Oh, that's too expensive. I ain't I ain't a baller like that. I just want to put something on there so I can just put something on there. Put a little bit on there. And I had to go through them changes. You got to be careful when you got a glass top stove because what happens is the water spits down on there and then you got the fire, not a fire, but it gets sticky, sticky. We will probably let stay in the oven for about not that long. DJ. See, it's in the VA. Are you working and lurking also? If you are, thank you for coming through. It's funny how, like, all of us be working. Well, y'all work during the weekend, and I work on the weekend. I'm a weekend girl. See, that right there is, turn your back, uh, DJ Tanjan, that's the pork chops right there. Smother pork chops. See how I got a little, that little, little lightness on there? You put that with some mashed potatoes, you got a meal. I'm going to stick this whole thing in the oven. Remind me, Mom, to make sure that I do not stick my hand in there without a muffin, uh, the, the mitten, because if not, I'm going to tear my hand up. And we don't want that to happen. Cut the back eye out front. I like to be front and back. So let that boil. Let's push that around. Okay. Everybody's having a great day. I know I am. Feels like rain somewhere around this world. I thought the man was going to be out there. He might show up a little bit later to cut grass. Because normally he'd be cutting grass. What's wrong with your phone, Mom? Oh, I just heard him making that noise there. It's 2 3. 2 3, ma'am. Okay. I know, because you know, we know what time General Hospital come on. Um, the energy goddess says, we, we love you, Mom. Yeah. 
you know, my mom, my mom is a showstopper. She she's just be back there in the back. She she ain't saying anything today. She's being very nice. I don't know why she's being very nice, because I guess she hasn't seen me the last couple. Ma'am? Yeah, where you finna run off to? Uh-oh. Got a date? Okay. My mom says stuff like that. You know she ain't got no date. She just said it to make to make me smile. She's cool. She cool like that. Energy goddess, where's where bra at? Bra bra's probably working. Tell him when you see him, give him a hug for me. So this part right here is going to have the tortellini in it, which is the basically like the cheese and pasta. Um, what I'm going to do with that is we're going to take the mussels, those that like mussels. I don't eat mussels. All right now, DJ Big and ENT, you enjoy the rest of your day. Please don't work too hard. And thank you for coming through. And I'll see you in the Twitch streets when I got time to sit down. I'll be in your room. Everybody, if you see someone interesting, I don't say follow for follow because that doesn't make any sense. You can follow everybody across the street, but you still need to have the support of people in your room. So I don't say everybody follow everybody. If you find somebody interesting that you want to get to know, um, don't friend. Don't friend because they don't, don't need friends. You know, follow, go into their room, see what they got going on, and you like, support, subscribe. Bless. You back, Marty? I'm glad I missed you. <laughs> I ain't miss one kid. <laughs> you can't be gone too long. I miss you too much. You know, that few minutes of my life was gone. Well, I'm back. Uh, yeah. We're just going to let them boil right there. I have two bags. Do you want one bag of totally? Yeah, man. Yeah, one bag. Look, I'm not eating that. Mama, my mind is not interested on in eating right now. My mind is trying to get some for You know, I always talk about sleeping. Guess what happens? I don't do it. So we're going to. Um, how many minutes, Mom? But, ma'am, how many minutes? I don't know. I'll get about 20 minutes. 20 minutes? Either. How about, you want to do 10? Or yeah. 10? A 10 sound about a nice number. Right. Yeah, pork chop, I done flipped it. Yeah, it's done because I flipped it like two times. Too much of it dry. Right, we don't want no dry meat. We like dry meat that has some lubrication, some, some wetness to it. Now, to be honest with you, this meal would be, if DJ um, Big Mark was in the room, this would be more like a 30-minute meal because it doesn't really take that long. I'm just really taking long because I'm talking. So it really would it be like that. I'm using the, I'm using the whole bag. But why even put a little bit back? Because you know my mom always say, "You, why you don't use the whole the whole thing?" And then you got a little bit left over to be a waste. So we're not gonna do that. Four quarts of water, boil you frozen, reduce heat, simmer, stir, cook two to three minutes, tender, drink so quick, fast, and hurry. Now let me go back to. Let's go back the other way. Let's go back to the mussels. These you want? We're gonna use one box, mom. Or do you want both boxes? So what you have? This right here, mommy. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have the tortellini. I'm gonna have the shells to the side because you don't like your stuff mixed up. You know what I'm saying? That you can mix up. That I can mix up. Seafood. Seafood. I can mix it. In. Okay, we'll take that back. Then I will mix it up. I'm gonna drain the water off. Don't drain nothing. Don't drain the water off. 
Plus, is, the juice coming from the, uh, would you have one in the pot there? One, let me, let me drain, let me drain some of the water off. Matter of fact, I could take that back. Let me go ahead and drain all the water off, and I'll go ahead and use that. that. Let's see the packaging is empty. Let me drain all. Let me drain all the water off, and I'll use the vegetable broth. Okay. Whatever you want me to do. See this. Thank you so very much. Thank you so very much for the the chicken nuggets. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so very much. See, we discuss. This is discussion. This is discussion because I'm making something up as we go. But you know what? It's always good to have that next person. Thank you so much, Angie Goddesses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What in, in my mind, what I want to do is I want to, I could have went ahead and used the vegetable uh, stock instead, okay. of, instead of water. But I went ahead and poured the water in there, which, okay. which is okay. I'm going to drain this off and then I'm going to put the vegetable stock in there. And then we go ahead and toss the mussels together. Yeah, there you go. Right? Mm -hmm. Right. Thank you. Thank you, Mom. Because I should have went ahead and did it, but I was talking. to See, I can't chew gum and walk at the same time. But um, we're going to go ahead and do it that way. Just give it like five minutes to get the thing right. And then I'm going to use the broth. Then I'm going to put the mussels in there. If y'all never seen mussels before... These you can get the ones from the uh the seafood store or the fish market, market or whatever like that. But these right here, I'm gonna show you. These are already there. They said mussel exclusively farmed. These mussels were farmed, ma. That was it, farmed, cooked and frozen and locked in flavor and goodness. I'm just reading the box. Mussel meat. Hey, welcome, Lavender Pi Three. Welcome, welcome into the chat. We're just talking. How you doing today? I hope everybody's doing wonderful. I hope everybody's having a laugh because this is the comedy show. I know y'all gonna say, "What in the world is is Ziploc for?" Is you're hungry? Me too. But not for this. It's like Ziploc sealed. <laughs> well, I just be playing. I, well, I can't say that. I don't be playing. I be experimenting on some stuff because, like I said, this right here could be a 30-minute meal. But when you're talking and entertaining and laughing, it takes a little bit longer. I, I do not care for muscles. These are muscles. These are already uh, pre-packaged, pre-cooked muscles. I like... Seafood, I like shrimps, but I don't like mussels. I want mussels. No, I don't like mussels. My mom loves mussels. My mom loves all types of seafood, except me. I don't do that. Okay. Normally, the mussels will come into a shell. Yeah, the mussels, the mussels, Ma, Ma says the mussels are good. Did you say you want one, one bag more or two? Which one you get? That this right here? The small let's use that small part, right? This is a small part. Okay, well you can just put one in. Put one in there? Uh -huh. You won't have more you won't have more pasta than me. No, we mm -hmm. both of them. Okay, yeah. Yeah, this one here is the small part. This has the, the cheese tortellini in it. This one here's got the potatoes and stuff in it. So this is a small part. Good at DJ K Smooth 88. Hey, welcome. What you you love muscles, TV TMT? That's so nice. You see how it's Ziploc? Make you feel like you're doing something. You got to pull it, pull it out the bag. Well, you know what? To be honest, I think this might be the first time I made muscles because I, I don't, I don't like muscles. They didn't haven't done anything to me. I can say that much. I just don't like muscles. And I'm not throwing stuff on the floor. I do have a plastic bag down here. <laughs> I'm just trying to make sure I got the bag so I don't keep constantly turning my back on y'all going to the garbage again. So I do have a bag. I ain't throwing on the floor. 
I throw on the floor, I have to pick up. Oh, that looks beautiful down in there. That down there. We're gonna let that boil just a little bit. Now, what I also can do is, mommy, what I also can do is um when I get ready to toss the toss the the pasta in the the mussels with the vegetable stock, you know, I could probably sprinkle a little bit of cheese if you want just a little bit more cheese on the outside versus the cheese on the inside. Just to give you some. Uh -uh. Tuesday, happy Tuesday. Now these like the, the on the bag it says two to three minutes. And inside these little tortellinis, they are cheese. Oh, you know what I can do? I'm always thinking stuff. Sweet 100 still hanging in there with me. That's the water, sis. That lady stay on water more than she stay on land. I'll let that toss a little bit. And you know how I mean me and potatoes go way back. We have a fit every time. Stick your fork in and make sure they're tender. They're not tender. I ain't got to stick a fork in it yet, mommy. Because you know what? My potatoes wasn't even boiling yet. The water hot, but it's not boiling yet. But it takes a look. We got we got more time on that. It's fine. I just turned it. I just turned the fire up on it. Turn the fire up. Turn the fire up. DJ K Smooth 88. Are you working and lurking? Shout out to the workers and lurkers. I gotta drink this water. Boy, I tell you, you don't know how much you miss a glass of wine. I'll have my wine. Just in case I want to see my bottle. Ain't that a beautiful bottle right there? That's a beautiful bottle. I can't wait to pop that open. Mm. I think I could drink the water better if it was not cold. Cold water is just... Boiling, boiling, frying. One more minute. So we're going to let that just go ahead and beep itself out. I just want to keep that in there to keep it. What's that little moat? Yay. You you leave again May 1st? Sweet 100 leaves again Ma, May 1st. She going to go. Ma said she want to go. I wish we can go. Only in my mind. I be tripping and traveling in my mind. You working? Shout out to the workers. Shout out to DJ K's move. All the people that are working right now just give me so much oomph. That's why I work on the weekends. But I do work during the week. I gotta get, I gotta get my birthday money together. And we're almost there. We are almost there. So we're gonna have us a nice birthday. Aren't we, mommy? Yes, because you need it. You're gonna have a seafood. You ain't gonna have nothing. No, I, I didn't want like I didn't want to say that loud. Look, you ain't gonna have nothing. That's right, I know it. I was gonna surprise you with some stuff, but that's okay. I just messed that up. Sorry. You know what I was gonna do? I ain't gonna tell you. You know you don't get that, you're gonna get that seafood board. You know that's what you're gonna get. You're gonna get like two, three big old bags just for you. Because I don't I don't want that. You're going to eat all the seafood to your heart's desire. Ain't that something? Your birthday is May 22nd and my birthday is May 29th. Boop, 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 boop. May was a busy month. Yes, girlfriend. Yes. May was so busy. A little bit too busy. But ain't ready. Yeah, but ain't ready. Anniversary too. Uh -huh. Anniversary is the 5th. Boy, you got anniversary and Mother's Day and birthday. You so lucky. Oh, that's nice. I had two kids in May. Yes, you did. That you did. Because then their birthday's on the 10th, 10th and mine's on 29th. Yeah, but you had, you, you had the boss right here, baby. You had the boss. 
Me. You hit me. I know you did. Oh, I'm so crazy. I am really, really crazy. Your birthday is May 29th? No, excuse me, April 29th? All, all in May. Your birthday, April? Well, my daughter's birthday is April 24th, and she's about to do it up down there in South Carolina, down there in um, Bishopville. She's about to turn up down that way. Uh, Chirac would be, what, 36? Yeah, she'd be 36. God, I'm old. Yeah, my oldest child be 36 years old. Crazy as all of outdoors. So we're going to go ahead and take this. Let me see. We're going to go ahead and take these. Um, like, how did they put the cheese in the dough? Oh, okay. That makes sense. Um, Yeah, she'd be 36. My oldest child be 36. Shoot, uh, Nevaeh, Nevaeh be, Nevaeh be 30, uh, be 21 this year, I believe. Yeah, my oldest grandchild be 21. Oof, I am really getting old. So this is what we're going to do. I'm going to take, I'm going to, I should have went ahead and put the, the, the vegetable stock in and boil it that way so it can go through the cheese and for the flavors. But you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take this and drain this off. Watch out for the eye. Don't burp yourself. You say drain the water? Yes, ma'am. Let me, let, me, let me listen to, let me multitask and, and think what I can say. Yeah, it says, Mommy. Hold up. Mommy, it's right there in front of you. <laughs> it says two, three minutes, and then it says to drain. Drain access? Water, right? Yeah. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is drain the water off of this. Flip that back in there. Flip that back into the um, pot. And then I'm not going to pour all of this in there. So this is what that looks like. That's what that looks like. That's the tortellini with the... Oh, ma'am? You don't want... Don't put that in there. Mm -hmm. Okay, do you sprinkle some cheese? Juice come out the uh, juice gonna come out of the, out of there. Yeah. Okay. Well, okay. So don't do that then. Okay. So I'm just gonna drop this because this right here already they're already cooked. They're already cooked. Working on it. You working on a birthday raid? On the for the 29th of April. When did what day does the 29th fall on? I don't know that far yet. Let me know so I can mark my calendar. These are already cooked and they just froze them and vacuum sealed them back in there. Yeah, let me know, DJ Smooth, DJ K Smooth 88. Ma said, do not. So. Looks like a plane. So, mommy, let me ask you a question. Can I sprinkle a little bit of uh, pepper, salt and pepper into this? You got a season pack over there, right? What season pack do I have, Mom? Um, what season pack? Oh, you mean the the top? You told me now that you told me how to put the uh the vegetable stock in that. You told me I do that, so I didn't do it. Oh. So you know what I. I do have to do something, mommy. I do have to put, it looks, I got it. Looks look fairly dullish. Don't add nothing, just the packet say add it. Smiles, you, you, okay, so do, do the muscles have any flavor to it? Yeah, they don't have Oh, well, I don't eat it. I don't, I don't. Okay, there you go again. You're not listening. Being a bad girl. Spank me, Ma. Spank me. Like, 
I can't say what I want to say out loud because it's going to be bad. I ain't going to say, never mind, mom. This is never mind. Just never mind. I hear it say, smack me, mommy. Sister. I, you can mess with me because you're my mom. Can I sprinkle some, some Parmesan cheese on it? Okay, just don't go too crazy now. Mommy, you... Oh. I mean, you can't, we can't cook. Yes, we can cook. Yes, we can cook oh, together. Oh, wow. You know, wow. Wilding out. You don't want to go wilding out. Only wild. Oh, I don't only wild out on Wednesdays. Today's Tuesday. But, Mommy. Okay, I ain't doing that. I ain't doing that with it. I'm going to do it. This is the way it is. I ain't going to touch it. I ain't going to do nothing to it, Mommy D. I ain't, I'm not even going to look at it. <laughs> I, I ain't gonna do that. I'm not going to do that else to it. I'm going to leave it alone. I'm going to leave it alone. I'm going to leave it alone. My, I'm, I'm going to leave it alone. Hey, Miss Kitty, you got to be doing that. The place I don't want to go. You can go, Ma. Go for do the Will Smith on you, do you? It's not funny. <laughs> You made me go. Yeah. I'm about ready to open my wine and I like Lord my no don't say my Baby no I'm not gonna I know you're not gonna touch me. I'm I'll let you hit me. I I will take it like I will take it. Okay, so I didn't think I'm violent by me. You're not violent. Not valid. No, I ain't gonna hit you back. I ain't stupid. I might be crazy, but I ain't stupid. <laughs> Ma. So Ma said, so Ma said, y'all, everybody, I want every, you, you, you good? Okay. Then. Ma said that this is, okay, this is the I'm gonna plate that up. So this this right here is the 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 cheese tortellini with the mussels in it. Ma said, do not add any uh, flavoring to it because the flavor is in the mussels. I want mussels. So the mussels have flavor in it, and it's got the cheese and stuff. We, this is gonna be very nice and pretty when I plate that up. Yes, my mama is not a violent woman. She would not hit me, and I would not hit her because I want to live to see my next birthday very soon. So that's pretty much done right there, ladies and gentlemen. All I'm going to do is plate that up because I ain't messing with my mom. I'm not going to do that because my mama's a sweet woman. And I will not do anything to hurt my love. That's my love. So we'll plate that up. And yeah, you you know. Well, oh. Chazzy Lissis. Where is she? Is she in the room? Tell her. Tell her, hey, because she's on, I believe she's on also, who's also another fabulous chef up here on Twitch. Yes. Um. No, I would never do anything to harm my mama. I ain't crazy. I might act crazy, but trust and believe I ain't crazy. I would never do anything for the love of my life. The one that gave me air to breathe and food in my stomach and clothes on my back. You like that? It sounds good, didn't it? I like that too. I just thought of that. I had a long day. I ain't had no sleep. So basically, we just gonna um I'm waiting for my potatoes to boil. And we're gonna mash these puppies down. I'm crazy. I really am. Chaz delicious. How are you? Your hands are dirty. You still cooking? What you cooking, love? What you got going on in your neck of the woods? Because my neck of the woods is definitely going on. Yep. Yes. Chaz Delicious. She be her one year Twitch anniversary is coming up soon. I saw that. I, I retweeted that out for you also. Can you imagine your year came by so fast? I think my year is coming up sometime. I want to say, I want to say. I want to say April. I don't know why I want to say April, but I, you know, but congratulations, congrats, congrats, congrats. 
you know, where that bought us a few more minutes. I'm gonna take that. I am going to add some heavy cream. I'm going to add my um, scallions because I didn't use all those in there. Um, I'm also going to add probably some, I think, I, my, do I have some sour cream in it? I'm going to mix all that up in that bad boy. I'm just going to intertwine that together. The beef um, empanadas. You made the beef empanadas. That's, that's good. You know, I'll never do anything like that because I just be. Empanadas are good. They're really, really good. If you got chicken, it'd be even better. But beef is good. Beef is good. So what we got going on over here is um, I took some cheese tortellini and some mussels for my mom because mom likes mussels. So basically, you know, we, we kept it simple because that's how it is. Mom said the mussels already have seasoning in it because the ones that I buy, it's already um, pre-cooked. Well, already cooked and frozen, whatever. And just went ahead and just really nicely tossed that with some with the cheesy noodles and so forth right there. Nothing, nothing too much. That's Mom Dukes right there. You know, Mom's very simple, straight to the point, plain, chop, chop, moo, moo. Thank you, sis. And then for those that eat pork, I got the in the oven. I can pull that out because we don't want that to get dry. Um, just the boneless pork chop, just the pork chop itself. We went ahead and smothered it. Just did a little small coating with um, butter, a little bit of uh, virgin oil, a uh, little drench of flour on both sides. Pat, 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 pat. And then we got it in the oven. I'm going to pull that out of the oven because guess what? You don't want your meat to get what? Dry. Ma, I said, let's make sure I put the, the thing because I don't want to go in there and pull that slick out and then pull my skin and have skin on the thing. This is the first time that I took the whole entire uh Mm, things like that. The copper chef. That's what that looks like. That's the pork chop with no bones. See how it's still looking all pretty right there? It's a little simple. Simple. Simple meal. Because that's just how my family is. They just simple. That's just the pork chops. Um, seasoned salt and pepper with a little bit of scallions. And then we got the red potatoes with the skin on. Because I really had a taste for some mashed potatoes. Because every once in a while you got to have some taters in your life. You got to have some starch. Substance. Now I got hiccups. You got to have a little substance. We're going to mash that down. Flip flop that around. And so, you know, we'll have, we'll plate up. Because we like to plate our stuff up and we do our pictures and stuff. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Like Chaz Delicious and everybody else up here knows like when we're cooking these 30 minute meals. Could be could be 30 minute meals if we wasn't up here talking and laughing and, and socializing. And yes, the potato is done because guess what? You take a spoon with a fork and you do that and you make a smash like that, your taters are done. Taters. And I went ahead and sliced them. That way I can really have time with them. Oh yeah, they 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 beautiful. Me and potatoes go, we go way back like car seats. Oh yeah, them dumb puppies, right? We're going to drain those. Thank you, Chad. So this is to stop what you, well, I can't say stop what you're doing because you're cooking the same time I'm cooking. So we're cooking together. That's so sweet. That ain't nothing but love right there. Okay, I'm going to take the, I'm going to take this pot. That's the pot. See right here. Thank you so very much. DJ K Smooth 88. Thank you for the chicken nuggets. That's see how that, this. Pot is no joke. So I got that right there just draining just a little bit. I'm going to put a top on that right there because I don't want that to dry out. We don't want nothing around here that gets dry. And, you know, we put our pictures up on TikTok, TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, you name it, we're on it. And when I have some time, Out of my busy schedule, I'm just putting that top on there just so that I, you like to see me touch that too. I didn't touch it. Something saying no. My mind's telling me no. Do not touch that because it's hot. It's hot. So we're going to use, yeah, I got some sour cream on the day. I bought some. I'm going to use the heavy whipping cream, heavy whipping cream, sour cream. Just so that my potatoes could be smooth. I like smooth potatoes. 
I feel so happy because I said I want some potatoes. I'm going to throw them on onions. What are you doing, Mommy? Mommy, why are you, why are you talking to me like that? You going to talk about you going to smack me like whip sniffing? What's going on, girlfriend? What's the reason about that? Oh, okay. I don't know why I actually can't help you find it, but it's all right. I'm leaving you. I'm cooking for the ones I love. I'm just, just being silly sometimes. Just a little sour cream in there. Probably a couple of nice dollops. Doop, doop. I love you too. Doop, doop. A dollop of Daisy. Now I do all this and guess what? I say, man, I'm just going to have to eat my potatoes later. Will it be okay if I drop some scallions in the in the potatoes? Yeah, that'd be nice. That'd, that'd be nice? That'd be, that'd be coloring? Yeah. See, she loves me now. She She's my friend now. Beforehand, she about to smack me beside my head. Was that what, um, Dr. Clay Rogers? That was the, the red skin potatoes I got draining over there in the on the side right there. Um, and that's just um, the heavy whipping cream and some sour cream. Yeah, that's sour cream. So it can get creamy. I like I like my potatoes to be creamy. Creamy. Yeah, sour cream. And I'm going to throw some scallions in there. Because you know what? Ain't nothing better but a lot of onion. Little scallions in there for, for coloring purposes. Oh, Okay. I put some black pepper in there, but guess what? I forgot my season salt. I season I season the food, right? But I don't season the food at the table. Oh, Phil, no, that's that's no, that's not Philadelphia. I don't have any Philadelphia. That's like food line. Food line sour cream. But you can use Philadelphia cream cheese too if you got it. I don't have it. Oh, baby. Ooh. Honey. Hunty. Got Taylor right there, right, Ma? Woo! Had that like stop and heart. That Taylor there is right. Slide in the park, baby. Slide in the park, baby. That Taylor right. Ooh. I can't. Ooh. Mm, I can't say. That potato hit that spot, Ma. I can't tell you when the last time I had me a nice mashed potato. I'm crazy. I'm crazy and I know it. Philadelphia cream cheese is very, very good also. This right here is my um like my mash my masher for my beef beef hamburger meat, but it also masses this very well too. I'll be putting myself to work. I'll be making my own exercise, mashing potatoes. I'm gonna throw some butter in there. I'm gonna place some butter. I'm not gonna throw no butter. I'm gonna place some butter. I'm gonna slam me about a, a couple of spoonfuls of butter in there also. Then I might even throw me, well, I'm gonna be nice because you know everything goes better with cheese. I think when you use your leave the skin on your potato, it also gives you another flair. We're going for color, some different types of color today. This also can double up as a weapon too. Just beat it. You know it. Just beat it. Beat it. Smash, 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 smash. That sounds so creamy. You hear that, mommy? Sounds so creamy. Potato sounds creamy. I do have a masher, but I, I do have a masher right here. And you working it. Yeah, I have a masher right here. But you know what? I like to do it my, my old-fashioned way with my hand somewhat versus having that.
Shout out to my worker. Shout out to my work. Cauliflower. Yes. I'm going to try that next time too, sis. Some cauliflower. Did we do cauliflower mashed potatoes before, Molly? I know we did, we did quali cauliflower something. But yeah, we're going to try that too. Because you know what? You want the kids to eat um your vegetables. So you can slide that in there. We're all grown now. So we don't have to slide too much in, in anything. We're going we gonna to eat it. We're going to eat it. But I love the red skin potatoes. And, you know, I got the little ones, too, so. And that was a whole, mommy, well, no, I used the whole bag. The whole bag for The little itty bitty potatoes were that, that, they were that big. They were little, they were little eye potatoes. They came from the field, from the little field in the back. They let the adults go first and the kids were last. So that's why it looked like that. I make up stories as I go because I be entertaining my own self. But it don't look bad. It smells good. We be plating up. You know, I'm always thinking of something, sis. You know how I do. Has bro you? I was asking you the other day on a regular show, but not on that raid train that he was in the other day. Did he use his um? Did he use his drop? His new drop? Or he's still using the the other one that you like? Now I don't want to overwork my taters because then I'm having every. Well, I don't work them suckers down. I won't mash them no more. I mash them anymore, they'd be like gone. He probably he probably hasn't used it yet because he likes the other one so so much. You like the other one so much, he probably hasn't even y'all hasn't used it yet. I've been in DJ K Smooth 88's room and I still never heard those over there yet, but maybe one day he'll surprise me. Well, that's that, babies. That's pretty nice. Let me let y'all see what that looks like. I didn't even add no... Hold up. I didn't add any butter to that. He used them. Um, yep. He used them. Um, sour cream. That sour cream and that the, the onion as like a chive. We're going to eat that all by myself and don't share. But I would do that because that's not what you're supposed to share. But that's good. That is wonderful. One day full. So, I might, I might, let me see. Can I plate? Let me plate. Sis, you want me to plate? Because I know you probably say, yes, plate. Let me plate for my sis. I'm going to plate for my sis. I got to plate for her because she always asks me to plate. Well, uh, plate I'll finish. Oh, yeah. What plate should I use, Mom? I always, I, when I plate my food, when I start doing the pictures and stuff, I try to do, 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 do. Wait a minute. Dinica, bro, sis gave you a drop, a bomb. You know how we do. So when when I do my when I do my plate up, I try to uh, showcase the vegan wine and whatever I am fixing at that particular time. Um, then I have a lot to do with my plates as far as saying what plate do I want to use as far as color wise, because that way you can see better on the plate. Oh. I didn't do any dessert today because guess what? We did dessert last week. Black plate. Black plate or the white plate? Mommy. Baby girl. My mama. You know what? My mama just, just tones me out. I bet you if I fall down, would you pay attention to me, Dave? Yes, you would. Because you're a mom. Take it back. So what we're going to do when I get ready, when I'm plating up, you know, well, Mott's not here yet, but he'll be here shortly. I normally fix my brother's plate. 
and sis never gets a chance to see me plate. So I'm just, I'm just doing this for sis purposes. See that right now? Yeah, I'm just doing this for sis purposes. Dr. D.D. Priest, welcome. Welcome to the room. Welcome to the chat. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm just showing sis, sis never get a chance to see me plate up and I'm just plating up because sis don't never get a chance to see me do it. And then sometimes as she sees the pictures afterwards. So I'm figuring out how to stop what I'm doing and let her see it now. Oh, this is the bottom of the pork chops. Those that don't eat pork, turn around. See how I got the little lines on the bottom of it? Thanks to the uh, Copper Chef pans, you get lines on the bottom of your pork chops. To be honest, but you know what? I'm going to do it like this because guess what? I can wash my dishes. He's not going to eat all this at one time. He's not that type of eater. But you know, when you plating up and I want to wash my dishes, I'll go ahead and do it just like that right now. I think that's a nice colorful plate. It has some brown gravy or something like that. You can um, also place that on top. It won't go like that. It'll probably go like something like this. Something like that right there. But I do it like this. That way I can go ahead and wash my wash my plate. Because when, um, when, we, when we raid into people's rooms and everything, I don't normally go right then because I try to keep cleaning as I go. Because if I stop cleaning, guess what happens? My kitchen will not get done. So I have to just keep on, have to keep on going and make sure it gets done. I try not to ask my mom to do my kitchen because it doesn't be my fault because I messed my kitchen up. So I try to do it myself. And since I don't have, I put my glass, my empty glass of wine because I'm not drinking wine today. But I would, I will be back. I will be back on Living Color Special next week because I don't have to have any glass of wine. Yeah, I, I ain't had no one today. Nah. Because I don't, I don't want to have a headache going to work night. We don't want that. We don't want a headache. Don't want a headache going to work, mommy. Mm -mm. Don't want that. Okay. Presentation is everything. Because we eat with our eyes before we eat with our stomach. That's a cute little plate. Okay. So that's broad plate right there. That's for a plate. And then with mom, mom's plate, since she's not having any mashed potatoes, I'm going to, mom, I'm going to take your plate. Because he went to go visit the other brother, so um, he'll get that when he get back. I'm going to take your stuff, Ma, and put it in the big white bowl. Put my put my stuff in the white bowl. And Chazzy listens when she does hers. She does hers the same exact way. She'll go ahead and she'll plate hers up. Um, Mish Mish does the same exact thing. I took it back out. Does the same exact thing when it comes to plating up. And everybody takes pictures. Ma's not going to eat all this. I'm just doing it so I can clean the pot out so that I can wash dishes. I probably just, uh, with this here, I might throw a little bit of parsley for color. I'm not going to put too much in that plate because Ma's not going to eat that much. You wonder what she don't eat, we can put this to the side for later. So, good Oh, she's a, well, you know, if you, you, you got to do what you got to do to make them happy. And she makes me happy just by her sitting across the room, not half the time, not paying attention to me. Uh, what? You cook in your dad that? 
Oh, well, that, well that's nice. That's nice. No, I don't let my mom do it. I, I try not to let my mom do too much anything in the house. I want my mom, she's the queen of the house, so she don't do jack. I mean, she cleans her room and stuff like that, but when it comes to my kitchen and everything like that, she ain't got to worry about that. Even when she does her dish, like, make, like, use her pots or whatever like that, or whatever she do, I wash them. No, she don't, no. All my mama do is she needs to sit down and come to the table. I make her breakfast when, you know, I got time and I, I'm not sleep or whatever. I get up and make her breakfast and everything, so, you know. That's all. That's like our, our little quality time. So my brother spends all the time with her. God, God bless him. God bless the boy. But you know, I ain't mad. So that that'd be how that is. I just went ahead and threw a little bit of parsley up there just for color purposes. And I'll put that right over here in front of my little board. And that's what I do with that. That's what I do. And that'd be another picture right there. Damn. So y'all y'all see how I cook and then I clean and then take pictures. And that's that's how that look and that's how that's how it works. One, two, three, four, five. Easy, easy, easy peasy. DJ, DJ, Dr. Dainty Priest, how is your day? Are you working and lurking also? And if you are, thank you for popping in. That makes my day so much wonderful to see everybody come in. Basically, when I come on like this is that I can get a chance to see everybody and make sure everybody's, you know, okay. Everybody's all right. Because everybody be so busy. I love you too, sis. You know I love you, mate. You know I love you, sis. I love you. Right down. Mommy, you got nine more minutes before General Hospital comes on. Okay, thank you. Yes, ma'am. You don't know her. I don't know mine, and I'm not even going to even ask you because that that I'm not going there with you, my D. I'm not doing it, my D. Later, baby. See you later. If I don't, you gonna come back out? Are you gonna come back out at four? Okay, I may not be out at four. I gotta lay down, ma'am. Mommy, I'm so hyped. I can't sleep, girl. I can't sleep. But I will go. I'll go count some sheep or something. Or count some dogs or something. I'll find something to count so I can go sleep. That's what that's that's showing will be a given. And Stella, hey, you laughing. How are you, Aunt Stella? Welcome, welcome. Come on into the room. Come on in the room. Come on in the room. So basically, since you came in, this right here is mom's plate. This is the cheese tortellini with mussels because ma likes mussels i don't eat mussels and then the then my bra plate for those that eat pork which he's not gonna eat all this at one time because he do he crazy but um i put his food i put his food in the microwave i just went ahead and placed all of the um i like that i placed all of the pork chop smothered pork chop and the mashed potato with the red um red red skin in the microwave, he'll get that when he gets no. He won't eat all of it. He'll eat some of it and he'll probably put the rest away. But you know, that's that's the family meal. Thank you, thank you. Hey, how are you? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Yep, I like that pickle going there. Yes, and we do. Yeah. So yeah, so that's this, like I said, this right here would be your 30 minute meal if you wasn't talking, if you was feeding your family. This had been done like 30 minutes ago. Two different meals. You got your starch. You yeah, definitely got your starch. I'm going to eat some of that. I'm going to eat some of that while right here in front of y'all. What are you doing? I hear you. I hear you clicking. Because I know what's going to happen. I'm not going to eat later. That's a bad thing to say. Matter of fact, I wanted a, I wanted a bowl of cereal, but I couldn't find the almond milk, so can't have no cereal. I can't have no cereal. So I'm just going to eat just a couple of spoonful of the taters. So all I can have is a couple of spoonful because I can't lay down with all that food on my stomach. Then I'd be too messed up. But you know me. To be honest with you, I cannot eat anything. I cannot eat anything without my added spice. My jar is low. This right here is my chili garlic so uh, sauce. It's low. I scrape the bottom now. You know, I gotta have, I gotta have, that's probably why my stomach's messed up with the GERD that I got going on right now because I eat too much spicy stuff. But it's okay. 
I would live to see another day. What? Yes, that's that. <laughs> that's right, Doctor Clay Rogers. That's probably why I got GERD. Well, I don't eat spicy foods all the time. Just when I have chicken, and like I have right now. But see. I put that in my food. But see, I had this bottle of Valencia for a minute. Hey, uh, the DJ Rock Experience, welcome, welcome. I had the, this bottle of Valencia for a long time. I haven't even et opened that yet. And then, you know, I had to have my, my sriracha. I haven't even opened that either. So I ain't have a lot of hot sauce stuff yet. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, um... Mm. Oh, that hit right down to the toe. Yes. It's good. Yes, yes, yes. Sis, if is he on yet? <clears throat> oh, this is so good. I, I think it's so rude for me to stand here and y'all can't have some. And I'm eating. That's not right. But I ain't going to sleep, sis. I ain't going to sleep. I got to wash the dishes first. And then I'll go take me a shower and talk to Mr. Sandman. But I want everybody to hang in there with me for a few minutes. Just a few minutes. Oh, my goodness. Dictators are good. This is the first show I've ever done with not having wine, not having soda, and not having chicken. I got to make up for that. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh, I might bring a whole big old bowl of mashed potatoes to work tonight. Oh. They are. So, Mr. Sandman is not going to come fast enough. I don't have any Unisom, and I can't take Unisom because I don't have any more, but I can't do it now because it's too late. Mm. But I thank everybody, all my streamers, all my friends, all my family. No, he's not. Okay, hold on a second. Hold on. Hold on a minute. Because I want to show somebody some love. So I can clean my kitchen. But now we're just staying right here. And, and I'm waiting for this text to come through. Because these mashed potatoes are good with this with the chili sauce. Mm. I love you. Okay. Sis, he said he's on now. Okay, cool. Thank you, baby. Oh, this is what I want to do. I want to show some love to one of my cohorts. And everybody knows him. He's also a brother in love. Don't nobody go. We're going to raid over to who? DJ G, the Merciless. Yes, Lady Cadaver says, stay in the room. I got you. It's mashed potatoes. Thank you to my doctors. Thank you to my streamers. Thank you to my shout out to my workers, my lurkers, those in the front, those in the back. I hope y'all enjoyed this wonderful blend of meal that I did today. And we'll do it, God willing, we'll do it all again, again, Tuesday. Brother, yes, brother's on. Brother's on. He comes in peace. And that's the least that I can do. Is show love to him as he showed love to me. Uh, everybody hang on in there. Please and thank you. Hang on in there. So we can go over to. Th thank you, DJ Tam Jam. I know you don't like pork. That's why I told you to turn your back. But everything else, the seafood, you can eat that. You I got you. I got you. We going. I'm gonna make some muscles for you. I sure will. Cause you like muscles. I'm gonna make sure that happens.
All right, just want to make sure that I can get everybody to go over. Hold that thought. I did it the wrong way. <laughs> Me, I crazy. All right. Here we riding. 